Welcome to our demonstration of NetSuite Suite Success for Financials First Standard Edition, in which we're going to show how to manage and report on budgets in NetSuite. For this video, I'm taking on the role of a controller. Here's a look at my dashboard. A wide variety of financial metrics and trending indicators shows how well your organization is managing the day-to-day -day financial operations. Let's look at the budget in the Tiles portlet, which presents whatever information I need on an up-to-the-minute daily basis. Each role can organize the workspace to fit a specific set of needs. As I click on the Budget versus Actual tile, I see the typical income statement style account level rows along the left, with the actual amounts from the transactions in columns next to the budgeted amounts and the variances to the right. Along the bottom of the NetSuite Financial Report Writer, I can adjust what relative time periods I'm interested in, choose different budget categories to display, and even select a different subsidiary context to display a subsidiary-specific budget for one of the parent organization's consolidated child subsidiaries. Finally, I can break out the totals across department, class, or location, and even the entire fiscal year's defined periods. Now I can begin to analyze the report and investigate actual numbers that may be of concern. When I notice the actual revenue numbers are unusually high, I simply click through the summary figure to see the detailed revenue transactions that tie out to the total for that period. In the detailed format listing report, the invoices and journals can be investigated one at a time, and with the proper permissions, I can even drill down another level into the source transactions themselves to comment or investigate the particulars of each amount. I can dig deeper into all details of a single transaction, who created and approved it, what other records might relate to it, the general ledger impact, and accounting details. I may also want to attach a note or file to the transaction or even send a communication to the customer directly from the Messages tab. A click on the Accounting tab here shows me the estimated gross profit on the right, along with the GL account, currency, and tax information on the transaction. All this information was just a few clicks away from our dashboard starting point, where this Home button returns us to finish this brief demonstration.